American assault convoy outward bound from Leyte through narrow Surigao Strait and the perilous Sulu Sea studded with Jap-held islands. One of the Pacific War's boldest strokes, the amphibious attack on Mindoro Island. The guns of Admiral Kincaid's 7th Fleet pour on the barrage. Jap planes attack from Indoro's excellent airstrip, others from Luzon, only minutes away by air. Akak batteries go to work with deadly aim. Sykes trained on another Jap, and down he goes. Assault craft churn in toward the best landing beaches the Yanks have found in the Pacific. Veterans of Attu, Guam, New Britain, this is a pattern they have made their own, and this time hardly a Jap shot is fired. This paved the way for MacArthur's attack on Luzon, one more island reclaimed. Final battle for Leyte. Yanks of the famous Statue of Liberty Division move forward past the monastery that was the scene of bloody Jap resistance. Tanks landed from the sea, slam at the rear of Jap forces caught between two American fires but still fighting back. Gunners to their posts on the double. Nip barge sneaking into land reinforcements sunk by artillery and bazooka rackets. Desperate fighting marks the American advance across the island. building probed for Japs. There is no easy road to victory. Medical corpsmen under fire bringing in the wounded. Leyte cost us some 11,000 casualties. It cost the enemy 10 times as many. A grim, bloody business. Plasma given on the move under constant enemy sniping. Leyte is an epic in itself. Here the Yanks took everything the Japs had and never stopped. Major General Andy Bruce cheering his wounded. His 77th Division made history, wiping Leyte...